What's up, folks? Black Sun again once more. Sunny side, Johan is back. All the way, all the way, yeah. And my topic today in this episode is a special note. Now, listen to this one. I'm gonna crack your bones with this one. We're talking about the Mandela effect. The Mandela effect, an illusion in time. We're going through, we're suffering an illusion in time. So, we're talking about the word Mandela, you know? Not the person, but the energy, the frequency, the energy or the sorcery that was used to contaminate the nervous system of the people of Southern Africa or Azania. Now let's go deeper, let's go deeper, all right? We're talking about the Mandela effect. We're talking about at a point in time in your body where you're reflecting an illusion of yourself as a hero that never happened as an ego that out, that's outstead by its own mind your mind took over yourself your mind got quicker than you your mind outsmarted you and created itself an ego before you now you're suffering the illusion of your own soul now outside you look great outside you feel great but you're talking nonsense inside your own body that's an illusion in time we're talking about the mind and effect you understand we're talking about acquiring knowledge to get over certain mishaps that the body uses to create itself stories inside your body of the world that happen in an era that never happened. So you're going through a psychological mental enslavement. So the body is getting arrested by its own thoughts, its own tension. Remember you have to come from a family to understand how DNA works. Because when it, when it replicates into a gene, it plays a story. You can't just get out of there with that saying, I'm done. When DNA replicates, it creates a story, which is a gene. Then the protein is the movement of this body. So if you can understand the magic of DNA, you can understand the imagination that got to go by the thoughts. When the effect of a story being announced on a solar system, you understand, on a collective, on a universal anthem of every being. Now this has to be in time in order to take beings out of time. So it has to go through the whole universe. And that's what the story of South Africa or Azania goes. So now the kids are suffering this, this state of mind that never happened. And now the bodies are walking by freely, but they're, they're, they're having an outer body experience of a non a non-existing world. Now we, we have a European mindset, but we are culturally based. That's the problem. We, are, you, we have Europe like this. We have, we have this swag. This is Mandela, this is Mandela. Yo, yo, what's up? What's happening, man? What's happening, fam? Yo, I'm good. This is the Mandela effect. But yet, we are deep inside. So our bodies are trapped in here. Our heart is trapped in here. Then we have having this cold-heartedness inside when we're talking good that's universal so that's what mandela psychology has caused now when time moves is when you talk about a story that you have the answer to but you haven't experienced so you have the final copy the protein of you as a hero but you don't have the information of how to sit the hero how to talk a hero in the present moment remember the words can only get energized by the present moment that's why all the all the words cannot be present as much as you want to it's an inside job it's happening on itself it's quantum physics this one you can't sort it out by talking to me it's very deep inside we call it uh, the immaculate immaculate inception the Mandela effect is what intercepted intercepted the immaculate inception of the human body now we machines used our blood system has been intercepted by an, a, an unhappened story which has compromised our being. Now we've been hacked. Our subconscious has been hacked in South Africa. This is a state of emergency from the youth. So we're suffering that mental sickness, mental disease of partying and grooving and fucking every time while we're dead inside the present moment where the energy is. Our heart is filled up with European bullshit where the energy that's supposed to pick up its own imagination and create its own world is. So we're not imagining enough. We cannot imagine. Right? 
So we suffer in that state of sitting and complaining, but not be having the energy to do anything. And that's the Mandela effect, right? The American concept, the franchised version of our souls. Our soul has been franchised. So we need to remember how imagination works inside the present moment. And that's where our pineal gland connects with uh, the, the perception of time. The pineal gland connects with the perception of time that keeps you here, no matter how much, how many illusions get uh, shown inside in, in front of your eyes so that you can embark on your own journey and you can create your own imagination and stop suffering the Mandela effect because it's at the time that never happened. So your body will be captured. Your body will be put in a, in a loophole where it's imagining itself. But that, that place never happened. That place never, will never happen. The only place that happens is the now. So you should have your answers now. So that's the Mandela effect. The South African youth, youth is suffering the Mandela effect. South Africa is an underground machine which place spiritual higher self inside beings so they hack you if you don't if you're not woke in africa we hack your soul we take your soul that's how it is so this is to the woke this is a beautiful one get yourself out there, okay stop suffering the mandela effect